I'm trying to explain, especially to the rising generation, the nature of our present culture, where it's come from, what it looks like now, and where it may indeed be going. Because that generation has been born in this culture and really doesn't know anything else. I've watched the evolution of culture since the 60s and I've seen massive changes in it. And I think my witness about that will be helpful. A cataclysmic transformation of the very nature of our society. Isn't that interesting? This particular observer of the culture described what happened in the 60s as a cataclysmic transformation. In other words, what happened in the 60s is not the typical passing on of traditions from one generation to the next, which always occurs with some kind of conflict. This is special. Something strange happened. In a kind of an ironic turn of events, we are now seeing the withering away of secular humanism. The, the proof is how many people now say, I'm spiritual but not religious. In other words, they are making a claim to spirituality, which doesn't fit with secular humanism, right? That's superstition. Worshiping and serving the creature rather than the creator who's blessed wherever. Do you see that? A simple distinction that Paul gives us. He's telling us there are only two religions, right? But Paul is actually saying here, when you look at it, there are only two ways of being a human being on this earth. You either worship the creation or you worship the creator.